On our recent NCL cruise, I was on a mission to find and taste all of the included food. From the buffet, to the main dining room, to everything in between. I'll share all of the free food that you'll want to try. Hi there, I'm Ilana from Life Well Cruise. We recently returned from a cruise on board Norwegian Pearl. Although we were on a seven day cruise, we did have five cruise ports of call. This meant that I had a challenge to get to every included restaurant venue and included food option on our cruise. In this video, I share the various complimentary dining options on this NCL cruise ship. While your cruise ship might have different dining options, this video will give you a good idea of what to expect when it comes to dining on Norwegian Cruise Line. Main dining rooms. There are two main dining rooms on Norwegian Pearl each with a different atmosphere and decor. You can choose to eat at either of these as they are both included on your cruise. By the way, Norwegian Cruise Line is freestyle, so you can eat at your own schedule. Summer Palace. The beautiful and grand Summer Palace dining room has an elegant entrance with large windows overlooking the ship's wake. Summer Palace is open for breakfast daily, lunch on sea days, and dinner each night. We loved having breakfast at Summer Palace. The menu options are great. I particularly liked the bagels and smoked salmon, as well as eggs benedict. But there are eggs and bacon, pancakes, fruit parfaits, and more. Frank loved the banana caramel waffles. Even if you only do this once or twice during your cruise, consider having breakfast in the main dining room. The presentation is the best. Indigo is the other main dining room. This restaurant feels more contemporary. It's nice to have two included main dining rooms that feel different, although the menu options are the same in both. On the menu, you'll find appetizers, soups and salads, main dishes, and decadent desserts. One of my favorite appetizers was the chicken lettuce wrap. My husband Frank loved the Asian spareribs with a vegetable summer roll. By the way, something that Norwegian Cruise Line does really well is their food presentation. Just look at Frank's whole sirloin meal. He really enjoyed it too. Garden Cafe Buffet is open for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. There's everything that you could want in a buffet, including several stations, so you don't get caught up in long lineups or queues. At breakfast, you'll find an omelet station, eggs and bacon, cinnamon rolls, fresh fruit, cereals, and more. It's a great place to eat what you want at your own pace, especially if you have a busy day ahead. At lunch and dinner, you'll find the salad bar, pizza, cheese platters and charcuterie, a burger bar, a carving station, hard ice cream, fresh fruit and desserts. The Great Outdoors. This outdoor buffet is really a hidden gem. Located past the exterior doors of the Garden Cafe is an almost hidden outdoor buffet at the stern of the ship. It's a nice second buffet that most people don't know about. The buffet is perfect for meals as well as afternoon snacks when you come back from an excursion or even at the end of a sea day. Plus, there's tons of seating overlooking the ship's wake. Now you might want to know where to find the free soft serve ice cream. So there are actually two spots. One of them is at the Great Outdoors, right at the buffet. You're going to find a soft serve ice cream machine. And there is another one as well in the buffet. Oceans, also known as a local on some Norwegian cruise line ships, is open 24 hours for breakfast, lunch, dinner, and even late night snacks. Think American style comfort food meets Irish pub. The service is quick, yet you can get a really nice sit down casual meal here. Some of the most popular items on the menu are buffalo wings, cheeseburgers, and warm pretzels. Although I have to say, I loved having breakfast at Ocean's the best. I had the English breakfast. This is probably the best 24 hour dining venue at sea. Topsiders. Topsiders is a convenient casual poolside dining venue where you can get grilled burgers, hot dogs, and other barbecue style classics. There are a lot of outdoor tables, so you can eat poolside. Lotus Garden. Lotus Garden is one of those restaurants that most people think is an extra charge, but it is included. We went to Lotus Garden for a late lunch on a sea day and ate too much, but it was really good. There's a huge menu of well-known and lesser known Asian favorites, including spring rolls, general Tao chicken, and dumplings. You can also order sushi at an additional charge, but otherwise everything else on the menu is included. 
Although we really enjoyed some of the specialty restaurants on board this cruise ship, something that did surprise me is how many included restaurants and dining venues there were on this ship. From the elegant restaurant style of the main dining rooms to the casual venues, both sit down and self-serve, you definitely couldn't go hungry on this ship. Now, if you'd like to know more about Norwegian Pearl and what we loved most, be sure to check out the videos on NTL's YouTube channel or check out our Norwegian Pearl ship tour and experience video next on my YouTube channel. Now, please let me know if you have any questions about Norwegian Cruise Line's included food options and as well, if you have cruised with Norwegian Cruise Line before, if you've cruised with NCL, please let me know what are your favorite complimentary restaurants or foods down in the comments below. Now, I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, please do give it a big thumbs up. I really do appreciate it. And I will see you over in the next video. Bye for now and happy cruising.